New at 6, a local man turns to social media with hopes of finding his beloved dog. Little did he know, a complete stranger would step up and make a big difference. 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell with the story from Kiko Harbor. To Marty Bell, Steve Bernstein was a stranger. She knew him only on Facebook. I've never met him. But for some reason, she couldn't let go of a post the Kigo Harbor man made about his lost dog. He wrote, only help. It's the dog and I, and she's my best buddy. And I know she's an old dog, but the, the idea that we would have parted ways not knowing what happened to her and who knows what really would have happened to her, just I, I couldn't have lived with that. A flyer explained, Rosie went missing from a friend's house near Bell and Northwestern Highway in Southfield earlier this month while he went to a wedding out of town. He feared he'd never see his best friend of 15 and a half years again. Six o'clock at night and it was raining and I just jumped up and grabbed some flashlights and just drove to the area and started calling her name and yelling for about an hour and a half up and down the streets. Every time I heard a dog, I got out of my car and yelled. Wound up going to St. Joseph's Hospital. He collapsed because he was so upset and worried about his dog. I had passed out. I was um, on the floor of the restaurant with paramedics around. They both needed each other. Marty gave Southfield police her phone number as she ended her search. That night, she got a call. Someone heard her yelling for a dog and called police. They had Rosie. When Steve's neighbor found Rosie, she didn't just find his best friend. He says she saved his life. Marty really saved my life, to be honest with you. When you see somebody, you know, posting help, and that's all they post, well, you got to do something. But she's an angel to me. If angels could walk on earth, this lady is one. In Kigo Harbor, Kim Russell, 7 Action News.